Welcome to Mac Related Things. I'm your host, Jim Fair. Today we're talking about the Fusion Drive and how to fix a split Fusion Drive or how to simply reformat your Fusion Drive completely. Go up to Utilities and select Terminal. I'm going to push that into the corner and make things bigger with Command Shift Plus. So you can see what I'm doing. I'm going to drag the right hand edge of the screen out, make it easier. So the easiest way, if you have Mojave or later, is Disk Util Reset Fusion. It does all the work for us. But unfortunately, it doesn't always work. And of course, if you're earlier than Mojave, it's not going to work. So this, uh, we just type yes. It goes off and does all the work for us, which is great. So we just have to wait for this to go through and do its thing. And then we'll show you how to do it manually. So if we, uh, well, clear doesn't work. Uh, disk Util uh, CS list, and we'll show you the logical volume group we just created. We're we'll scroll back a bit. We got to copy that first logical volume group UUID with right click copy, and then we hit the uh, or command C. And then we hit the uh, up arrow to retrieve the last command. Get rid of the word list. Put in delete. Put the space. Paste in the UUID hit return and we are wiping the drive. So sometimes you'll have trouble unmounting this thing and you might have to jump into disk utility and unmount. But um, the, usually the delete command is able to do that. But just in case it doesn't, just be prepared for that. So now we go disk util cs create macintosh backslash space hd disk zero space disk one. Now with some iMacs, if you have the logic board replaced, you might have to change disk one to disk two. This particular machine, I know disk one works, so we're gonna hit that. So this is step one of the uh, create the fusion drive process. Step two, we're gonna create a volume as soon as this command spits out a UUID for us. So we're gonna copy this UUID with right click copy or command C and then we're going to go disk util CS create volume with a capital V space and then we paste in the UUID and space and then JHFS plus or journaled HFS plus is the file system and one more time Macintosh backslash space HD space and then one zero zero percent and uh, that's it now we can install the OS so that's all there is to it it's not really that difficult but uh, you do need to type in a few things in terminal which can be tedious uh, and kind of scary for the novice but um, you know as long as you have a good backup you should be just fine Anyway, that's all I have to say today. Thank you for watching and fade out.